Hey y'all, it's me Alex today for part of my 31 days of Halloween. I have a tutorial for Hypodermic Sally from American Horror Story Hotel. I've kind of been wanting to do this for a while. I think her makeup is very fabulous, very like dramatic 90s grunge glam, a lot of adjectives in there. It's pretty simple to do and like if you hate blending you will love this tutorial. So without further ado, let's just get started. So first I'm going to start off by actually doing my brows on camera for once. I'm just going to fill them in. We're not doing it super duper thick which is why I actually chose to do this on camera. So just fill it in thin and then apply some NYX HD eyeshadow primer as a base. And then I'm going to take my NYX black eyeliner pencil and just put that along the lower waterline and just do it really thick. Now I'm going to take the black shade out of my Kat Von D Shade and Light Eye Palette and use an e.l.f. eyeshadow brush to just put that all over my lid and really, really pack it on. We're not going to do a whole lot about, you know, it being messy or anything, so don't worry about that. And I'm also putting it along the lower lash line as well. Again, it can be messy. Now I'm going to take a clean brush and use that to blend out my crease. Now I'm going to use my Hotel palette and the white shade out of it from Strobe Cosmetics and use that on my brow bone. And I'm taking the Shade and Light Contour Kit and I'm taking the darkest shade and using that to contour my face. Again, don't worry about blending. It's supposed to be really, really dramatic, so that's why I chose the darkest shade there. Now I'm going to curl my lashes using my Ardell Eyelash Curler. And I'm going to apply a very thick layer of my Urban Decay Perversion Mascara on my upper and lower lashes. Now for my blush, I'm using the Lolita blush, and again, that's super pigmented, so that is why I am using that. I'm just putting that on my cheeks, and I'm using the same highlight that I used on my brow bone for my cheekbones and nose. And for my lips, I'm using Nosferatu by Kat Von D. It's fantastic, and I think it is just the perfect shade to top off this amazing look. And that is your finished look. Alright y'all, thank you so much for watching. Please be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe down below if you want to see more of my videos or more of my 31 days of Halloween videos. I'll also link the playlist down below and I will see you on my next video. I hope you'll have a wonderful day. Bye!